guys, welcome to Sunday vlog. We are leaving for Paris in just a few days. Um, we're actually going to Vancouver first for a day to visit my sister and drop off the schnauzers. Uh, okay, shh, that's too noisy. One has to come up. Um, and then we're leaving bright and early the next day. Um, so today is just packing for the most part because we still have tomorrow, but morning, but pretty much packing, but more importantly, trying things on, seeing what I want to take, um, and just, yeah, any last minute things. Um, but you know, the dog stuff, yes. We've planned what we want to do each day to an extent. We have a two day museum pass. And so those are going to be, it's going to be for Friday and Saturday um, so we're gonna see a lot of the museums then um, but then we'll also on other days just pay for single admission but that made the most sense so we're seeing that but we also based it on what's most important and then if we end up staying longer at one place what will take get taken off the list so it's gonna be a really busy vacation we have so many things planned but I'm so excited and we found a restaurant because <laughs> in all the movies, you know, those rom-coms, they show couples that eating in Paris and out their window they see the Eiffel Tower, which obviously is a green screen, but I really want to do that. <laughs> so <laughs> we found a restaurant that has vegetarian stuff and it's, the Eiffel Tower is far away, but still you get to see it all lit up at night while you have dinner. So I'm so excited. So we're going to be doing that on our last night, but oh, so exciting. Um, so I've already been up and about, or out and about. I went to my mom's house, walked the dogs, and I took a little trip trip, who had such a good time running all around. She hasn't been to that park in like a month, so she was so happy. Um, oh yeah, I ended up getting a new phone, so hopefully you noticed that this is better quality <laughs> than my old one. So I had a 5S, um, and it, I definitely wanted to get another iPhone, so I was looking between the 6, which would have been a lot cheaper, or the 6S, but then they were saying that, or at the cell phone place, that the 6S's camera is so much better, versus the 6 is this pretty much the same camera as my old 5S, so that was pretty much the only selling factor for me. So it was a little bit more, like 150 bucks extra, but I was like, I do all of my vlogging and photos and everything on the camera on my phone, so it was worth it for me. So I'm excited. Um, however, I I didn't want to buy, well, I already bought a screen protector for it, but I didn't buy a case yet. Okay, I just put you down. I didn't buy a case yet, and so I ordered one online because it's so much cheaper than buying it in store. They're like 60 bucks. So I ordered one online that's really pretty. Um, but I sent it to my sister in Vancouver um, because we're going there tomorrow. So anyways, in the meantime, I've been trying to take extra good care of my phone and I put it in a little Ziploc baggie <laughs> just to keep it protected in my purse and stuff so it doesn't get all scratched before I have the case on, so extra good care. So we're going to plan what to take along. So yes, we figured out we're taking the Metro from the airport, and then we get off at Saint-Michel, Notre-Dame, and then it's just a short walk, um, like eight minutes to our apartment is somewhere in here. Cool. I got sidetracked playing with the dogs. Uh, <laughs> Anyways, I'm meeting my friend to walk Molly and then her big dog and my friend's, I think her baby due date is this upcoming Thursday or something. So she's ready to pop, but she's still super active. And yeah. Um, so yeah, we're meeting the dogs dog walking and she's going to let me borrow her, like the bag that she actually bought in Paris, but she used the whole time. And I don't know if I'm going to use it yet, but um, she said for me to take a look and yeah, I can borrow it if I want. So just seeing if I see her yet and not yet, but then Molly gets to go for a walk. Not you girls. You girls good to go tonight later. Did you have fun meeting me? Are you tired? I have these packing cubes that I'm kind of excited to use, or at least to see. Um, I actually got them, it was before we went to Disney World, or Disneyland, but they didn't arrive in time, so I didn't actually get to use them. So they've just been sitting in the package until now. So now I'm finally taking them out, and I got two of them, and yeah, no, Dolly. 
Um, but my sister loved packing cubes, and she, like, swears by them. So there's just three. Actually, is this one, too? Oh, there's four sizes in here. So, and I have a different bag for my makeup and my toiletries bag. Okay, girls, no playing on the packing cubes. <laughs> but, I don't know. Especially since we're staying a night in Vancouver first. So I figure in one bag I will put, um, like, my pajamas and then what I'm wearing the next day in, I guess, this one. So when I'm staying the night at my sister, I just have to take that out and my toiletries um, but not everything. I guess that's what would make the most sense. But apparently it's a good space saver too, so I'm excited. Where are those other packs? I think it's the same type though, or like also four. Uh, yeah, just a different brand. I think I was hoping this would come. Oh yeah, it's also a four pack. So I asked Dan if he wanted to borrow these, but he said no. <laughs> that's okay. The bag, she's letting me borrow. And it's nice, it's zippered, and then inside there's another zipper pocket as well, and the whole thing is zippered. And the one thing I like is that if you don't put too much in it, it stays pretty flat. Because, like, you can't really see. But, let's see. Like there, it's really not that big. So, yeah, I am excited. I think actually I will use it. I wasn't sure, so I'm like, I'd love to, I said I haven't 100% decided what I'm gonna take for bags, um, but I agree like a crossbody bag is better than having to hold something, because here you don't have to worry about it. Because even when I have my purse over my jacket, um, sometimes I'm still like going like this and stuff. So anyways, this is a lot nicer. And it's purple, my favorite color. <laughs> so I'm going through my different outfits to see what I want to wear. So I'm not really a scarf person, but if I'm wearing like dark pants, and I'm just taking all black pants because I like my black pants. I have black jeans and then two pairs of dress pants that I pretty much live in. Chloe doesn't know that sound. Anyways, then I'm wearing my dark gray jacket as well. That's a rain jacket and it has some warmth to it. So I'm going to take one scarf and everyone says, you have to buy a scarf in Paris. Even Dan's mom was saying, tell, uh, tell, because we were asking them, oh, do you want anything from Paris? And then his mom was like, oh, get Chrissy to choose me out a scarf. So anyways, scarf. So I'm going to bring this one because I think this one is, I like the blue and yeah, it has some brightness to it. Like there, and it's a little shiny, so that's gonna be the scarf that I bring. Now the power has gone out. It's really windy and stormy, and I mean, it was has been flickering for the past hour, but no, it went out. Luckily it's still, oh, there we go. Oh, it came back on. Oh, I was gonna say, luckily it's still bright outside. It yeah, it may go up, it's, but it's still bright for a little while. Oh, now everything has to reset. <laughs> I just stopped filming and it went out again. Oh, wow. Well. <laughs> Whoa. That's pretty windy. Ah, that tree looks <laughs> here. <laughs> looks like the big tree cedar head just coming down. Ah, oh, look how crazy that is. Whoa. I can see why the power is out. But. Since you can't go on the computer and use the internet anyways, perfect time to pack. I kind of, well you can't see it because it's dark, but I put everything there that I want to bring. So now it just has to get into here. Wow, oh my gosh. Oh, uh, that looks like the tree's gonna fall. So I'm taking this little pop-up makeup thing. It just lays nice and flat in there. But then you put this down and then these go their compartments. So you can make it like that, and there's Velcro. I can't really show it with one hand too well. But then you can put your makeup here, and then there's space for other, oh, that's for the bottom, but yeah. And then there's space for brushes and stuff here, and then anything else there. So yeah, I always have to take that with me. And then, well, the bathroom is really small, but I'll probably, oh yeah, that reminds me, take, ugh my mirror along so I can do makeup by the window or something. Um, yeah, and have this just all together without my makeup because I have my makeup bag, but yeah, it's nice that if it's all out, I don't have to unzip everything, but it's still kept together. So I guess that's the point of it, <laughs> these packing cubes, so that you can roll things. I mean, that's a thick one, 
but and then they stay their shape because if I just stuck in the tooth or my suitcase if it's not like completely lined up so I'm going to be putting I think a little oh dear um, my suitcase isn't actually closed there's something in it but um something flat just right here because these ones are a little bit bigger but these are just small um just to make it and then just zip it up like that so I'm going to do a little bit more packing, um, but some things like my toiletries and stuff I still need tonight and tomorrow morning, so those can't. Um, but yeah, we have a washer dryer there and not sure if we're going to use it, but I took along a, a little sample of dish or not dish of laundry detergent um i always just make an effort to keep them in case of these circumstances or even if you don't have a washer you can just like do a hand wash in the sink but we do so i'm gonna take that along just in case um anyway soon we're going to be ordering from original joe's for dinner and heading over to my mom's hopefully she has power because it's just getting darker and darker hopefully original joe's has power but i figure even if they don't they must have a generator or something so and the nice thing with Original Joe's, and they actually say it on the menu too, um, soy chicken can be substituted for any meat on the menu, which is excellent. Although I was like, I should order a beef dip with soy chicken. <laughs> no, I wouldn't do that. Um, but yeah, last time I ordered, I was just looking at the menu in general, and some of the things that I was trying to get, it wasn't on the Victoria, the local menu. So anyways, when I came in, they're like, here, have a copy of our new menu. <laughs> so... We're going to have the butter chicken with soy chicken, teriyaki rice bowl with soy chicken. And so those ones are ones that I always have. And then the new one we're going to have is bruschetta fake chicken and feta, or fake chicken fettuccine. Did you say it bruschetta or bruschetta? I always thought it was bruschetta, but then when I watch like Giada on the Food Network, don't they say bruschetta? Yeah, but they're not actually trying to speak English. They're trying to be, pretend to be Because they Italian. are Italian. Well, they're not really Italian, but they're pretending to be Italian. It would be like me talking in a British accent. <laughs> no. It's kind of weird. Why would you talk in a British accent? He's because my, that, my family's oh, okay. originally from Britain, that's so true. that's me, like me talking in a British accent all the time. Or when He's all... people say liver and onions, I'll say liver and onions. <laughs> That'd be weird. No one does that. Why do they do it with Italian stuff? Do that. that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> he's all done his packing, so he's just done all there. Whereas I am still working on it. And I've packed up most of the dog stuff as well, aside from their food that they get to have soon. Even with the power was out, I went downstairs um, to the laundry room where it's dark because there's no like immediate windows. And of course, the, automatically I turn on the light and I'm like, oh right. And so now I turned it off. So when the power does come on, not that all the lights are actually pretty much all these lights will be on in the house. So we'll have to make a note to turn them off before we leave tonight. Um, so my mom's, hey schnauzers. Oh, you guys are just snuggling together. You just give me an evil blue eye. Mwah. The evil eye, but with her blue eye. All right, let's continue packing. Then we'll feed you. Then we order. I ordered in the past, and they're like, they're always like, oh yeah, it'll be ready in ten minutes. I'm like, ten minutes? I can't even get there in time, and I still have to do like fifteen minutes of stuff at home. So I'm gonna wait to order, and then watch now. It'll be like, oh, everyone's out of power, so they all came to dinner. So it'll be half an hour. Hope not. But I'll call my mom to see if she has power. It's not the one. It's not there. Uh, oh, okay, that's okay. That does look nice though. All right. We're out on our walk and it's pretty windy. Watch the dogs. Come on, girls. Both of them here. So we looked online and the power's still out at our house, which is annoying. Um, so we picked up, we went to Shoppers Drug Mart, we picked up, I wanted some gravel for the flight and then some granola bars just to have in my purse when we're walking around Paris if we can't find food right away and before I get hangry, <laughs> I have to have some food. So anyways, we have granola bars. Um, and now we're gonna go get a shamrock shake. I've never had one in my life. And Dan says they're mint milkshakes. So super high in calories, but 
we're gonna have one and I think I did try last year to get one and it was after Patrick St. Patrick's mm -hmm. Day and so they were like no we sold out and I'm like I finally made it in you guys are out so we're gonna go before because it's the week actually it is the week off now mm -hmm. Yeah, so they should yeah. have them. Okay, okay. I just don't want to go through the drive through and then it's like, no, we don't. And then we have to order something else that we don't actually want. Wow. Why would we have to do that? Because then we're going to go through drive through and then when it gets to the till where you have to pay, it's like, just keep going. Then we look so yeah. idiotic. Well, it's night time. You could probably back out. All right. Wow. All right. So we got everything there and then, yes, <laughs> then we're gonna go home to Molly because the house is probably cold. But I still had to, myself to edit this. I had some um, videos that I wanted to put on my computer or from my computer to my iPad and obviously it's, my computer's gonna die soon. <laughs> like I can't use it forever and ah. But hopefully the power comes on. Well, obviously it will, but hopefully it comes on soon. All right, trying my first ever shamrock shake. good. It's not that minty. <laughs> Very thick. Mm -hmm. mm. No, it's good though. Mm. I probably wouldn't buy it again, but it's nice. <laughs> when we were paying, we saw they also had, um, what was it, cream egg McFlurries. And I was like, we should have had that, but no, we don't need that. <laughs> Alright, so now we're going to go back to get the schnauzers. We didn't want to let them wait in the car the cold car and then home is cold too so and then we're gonna go home to molly and finish packing and cross our fingers that the power will be back on so i can edit this but i will let you guys know we are back home and the power just came on so yay so happy so i'm going to edit finish packing have a bath which also i was like i don't want to have a, like a cold bath because the hot water pump needs electricity and so anyway, so I was just like all this stuff I have to plan tomorrow I'm like I have to get up at like six which is really five all time and oh my goodness so so exciting we're going to Paris not tomorrow the next day but that's okay we're leaving Victoria tomorrow so next video you'll see from me will be a what I ate Wednesday I hope to post it sometime while we are in Paris so it'll go up as close to Wednesday as possible um I don't know if that will be possible um so we'll see but there will be Paris vlog so look forward to that too so thank you so much for watching today and this weekend and I will see you guys in Paris